North Korea to expel U.S. soldier Travis King, who crossed from South, state media reports, North Korea has decided to expel U.S. Army Private Travis King, who crossed into the North from South Korea during a tour of the Joint Security Area in July, state media KCNA reported on Wednesday, the relevant organ of the DPRK decided to expel Travis King, a soldier of the U.S. Army who illegally intruded into the territory of the DPRK, under the law of the Republic, KCNA said. The report said the investigation into King has been finished. It is unclear from KCNA's report where, when and how King would be expelled, King crossed the military demarcation line from South Korea into North Korea in July during a tour of the Joint Security Area inside the Demilitarized Zone, DMZ. King, a junior enlisted soldier assigned to U.S. Forces Korea, had faced assault charges in South Korea and was due to return to Fort Bliss, Texas, and be removed from the military just one day before he crossed into North Korea, CNN previously reported. North Korea claimed on Wednesday that King has confessed that he illegally intruded into the territory of the DPRK as he harbored ill feeling against inhuman maltreatment and racial discrimination within the U.S. Army and was disillusioned. About the unequal U.S. society CNN cannot verify whether these are King's own words, National Security Council spokesman John Kirby said last month that it would not be out of character for North Korea to use U.S. soldier Travis King as a propaganda tool or bargaining chip. They certainly could. We haven't seen any indication that that's exactly what's afoot here, but certainly would not be out of character for them, Kirby told CNN's Jake Tapper on the lead. What we're focused on is trying to make sure we can get information about him. Kirby added at that time that King's location was unclear, as well as the conditions he's being held and information about his health, this is a developing STO.